And after class, I usually take a nap or eat with friends. Tapos at night, you will be, you know what's up at night. You. Mm -mm. Hello. Hi. Hello, po. Hey, guys. What's poppin'? Hi. Girl, I'm so cute. Okay. I know I'm visual routine now. Depende, no? Before or after ako, umalis ng church. Choke! <laughs> Galing akong inom the night before, tapos pagising. Huwag na akong gagawin. Siyempre, inom tayo ng pundi. Tapos magtitimpla ng kape. And by 5.30, tapos kising na ako to prepare my breakfast. Kasi, hindi ko talaga kaya na walang breakfast. Hindi na ako nakakapag-breakfast eh, since wala na ako kaya ng time. So, diretso na ako sa class. Siyempre, ilang taga-tay at hindi <laughs> niligo pag umaga. Tapos, pumapasa ako sa klase ng nakapagbahay lang, tapos na kasi Pag hindi ako natutulog, doon ako nagmamaganda. Kasi, alam mo yung dead inside ka na, dead outside pa. Parang, no, not me. Usual routine ko back then was, majority of it was academics. Hindi ako nag at all, like, buong first year ko sa LB. Feeling ko, never ako nakakuha ng matinong aral. Madalas akong tumatambi sa Raimundo, tapos kumakain lang, o kaya sa mga coffee shops, just literally wasting time with my friends instead of doing assignments or going through 100 pages of readings. Usually, yun yung parang um, mag-macdo kayo, tapos parang mag mag-group study kayo dun. Tapos, ang tagal nyo at ang dami nyo ng in-order, pero parang kumain lang talaga kayo. Tapos, print mo lahat ng mga your lecture slides, pero wala ka pa rin natutunan because I don't know eh. Like, I'm just, I'm not feeling ko hindi naman ako bobo. Feeling ko, hindi, hindi lang ako maroon na magbasa. So, kapag vacant, madalas ay umuwi ako sa dorm para matulog. So, sa message ako ko, which is by the way, hindi lahat ng tagawensibok mayaman ako kasi lagi yung sinasabi yun. Na-organize ko yung mga gamit ko, um, nililista yung requirements, nililista na para hindi ginagawa. I usually um, eat out with friends, lalo na kapag sabay-sabay ko na vacant. Usual na linyahan na yun, after classes, Uy, vacant ko, tara, lunch tayo somewhere, ganyan. That's a favorite kong kainan apartment. Joke! Pag may pera, postinas, so kitchen or infusion cafe. Probably stable. Alright. Ostina. Soul Kitchen. Hebrews. So I usually eat here kapag start pa lang ng week. Kasi start ng week, complete pa yung allowance ko. So hindi pa siya nababawa. So that means hindi ko pa kailangan mag-tip bed. Sa lower end naman, kapag wala na akong pera, mga Friday ng hapon, lagi, kadabs, or Ellen's. Lahat ng karinderya sa Raimundo. Tapa, please. Doi Mills. Can see the rate. So, Selena, guys, masarap din doon. Tsaka, lalo na pag marami kayong time, tapos gusto nyo kukilalani ng masinsinan yung kasama nyo. Mm-mm. Piliin nyo na lang yung makakasama nyo kasi parang sa kwentuhan na matagal dyan nagsimula yung lola at lolo ko. Tapos pag ma may kailangan lang ang oras namin na kahit kayo sa Kataban, sa Melville's, or sa Latita Course kasi mabilis doon. Savior ng lahat ng mga UPLB students. Mahal na mahal ko si Tita Core. <laughs> Tawag nga namin doon Atit Choppers kasi yung nauso yung binabalibalik na. So yun, kaila Atit kami pupunta, sabay-sabay kami kumakain. And, yun, dami kong namin yung yes, grabe. Mga friends ko kasi pupunta lang sa lobby. Tapos kasi yun sila na yung mga mabibeso ko kasi we almost know everyone. Tapos, ngwari yung haba-haba na lalakarin mo. Tapos, kada, let's say, kanto, ganyan. Meron kang makaka-handshake kasi ang dami-dami mo. The people I miss the most in UPLB are my closest friends and my orgmates. And even the friends that I randomly say hi to when I walk around school. Yeah, I miss them too. Siyempre, <laughs> na-miss ko yung mga tao. Yung ingay sa square man or sa klase. And MWF varsity training sa basketball. I'm part of the volleyball team then, volleyball varsity team. And we'd have training from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. And then usually we'd have dinner. I miss my teammates ko since I'm a member of our dance varsity team, which is SJDC. So yun, we train sa Copeland. I think naman ng 4 p.m. ng hapon, I head to the field to train with my teammates sa Makiling Ultimate Club. We do conditioning and then 
Naglalaro na lang kami ng ultimate from 4 p.m. hanggang sundown. So after rehearsals, kakain kami ng mga um, kasama sa prod sa either Jollibee or minsan McDo or minsan nagtitake out na lang kami kasi some of us have production meetings pa after. We have dinner plans or meetings late in the night. Magpiprepare ka or if it's a Thursday or if it's a Friday and then you will have to dress up kasi iinom ka. Nami-miss ko pinom. <laughs> I miss you, my friend. 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 Dito sa Cubao nakatira, center of the universe nga pero wala ka naman makita mga bundok, wala ka naman makita mga puno, mga sapa, sperm bridge, wala mga ganong amoy eh. Nakakamiss lang yung marinig yung ingay ng mga batang naglalaro, yung yung sumasayaw, yung nagpa-practice ng choreography nila doon sa tapat ng DL Umali. Tapos yung mga nag-age kay yung nakakakita ng mga tumatakbo ganun. Imagine going outside your dorm and you're greeted by this fire tree every single day. It's one of the best things in UBLB. Oh, it's just a really gorgeous place to be in. Ang nami-miss ko sa LBI yung sense of security. Not security in a sense na um may mga guardia. Pero yung sick feeling mo secure ka kasi very familiar ka dun sa lugar. Marami kang good experiences don and nandun yung mga taong kakilala mo. Yun yung comfort zone mo. Yun yung comfort people mo. Um. Kapag nakikita mo yung lugar na yon, parang nakaramdam ka ng yakap, merong warms. The sense of community that you can find in LB, it's a lot different because unlike other schools, I guess, all of most of the people who are in UPLB are people who are boarding, who are, are people who are um, from different far off places. And so we go to LB and find a community of our own. And it's nice to um, to have that kind of um, comfort, and it's something that I definitely miss right now. So, pula talaga. As in, ang serap, ang serap mabuhay, ang serap ng buhay UPL. Hi, my name is JR, producer of Catch Up. Thank you so much for watching our very first episode. And if you enjoyed this episode, please make sure to give us a like, share, and follow us on our official social media accounts at UPLP Commerce. This series is brought to you by the UPLB Commerce Society in partnership with UPLB Coral and Sum, UPGoro, UPLB SJDC, UP Internet Freedom Network, UPLB Writers Club, and Makiling Ultimate Club. Tune in again next time as we catch up together. Thank you for watching!